Okay, so today we're going to be replacing the stock horn. Um, to do so, pop the hood, obviously. Then you have to remove this, this. You need to remove this thing here as well. So there's a bolt right here, a bolt right here, and then one right here. So you remove those three, pop out these five connectors. Then you'll be able to remove this, remove this as well. And then down in the front is where the horns are at. And this is what the stock horn sounds like currently. Beep, beep. I'm going to be replacing it with the Pia Superior Bass Horn, a uh, deep bass tone. So here's the horns. There's where you mount them. A little screw hole right on the bottom. Here's the connectors that come inside the bag. Okay, so we have the stock horn there. Um, I unplugged this wire here. This is going to be the positive. So if you're holding this one here, the negative is going to be the one closest to the mounting bracket. So we'll hook the positive up here. The negative wire which came in the box will hook there. And then we'll just put it right here. Mount it straight to the frame and then feed the screw through for the grounding connection. So let's go ahead and connect one up and let's give it a test. Okay, so we got the one wired in. Um, I unplugged the little wiring from the bottom right there. It's still pretty tight though. The wire hardly moves at all. Um, I just need a little bit of extra room just to get it to this pin connector. And then this ground one, I just looped it around and then connected it to that top bolt right there. So the one's done. I tested it. Now we're going to move on to the second one. Okay, so we have the second one all wired up. Same setup. I had to disconnect from or the little plug right there. So what I ended up doing is just looping the wire underneath that foam and then underneath that clip just to hold it a little tighter. Alright, so we got everything reassembled. And let's see how it sounds. And just a reminder, whenever you mount the horns, always mount them facing down. That way if you get any water that happens to make its way into the hood or anything like that, um, it doesn't go inside of it and pull in. <laughs> 